It's time for Titi and Ragnar to play games. Welcome, we are the Replay Bros. Today, the replay is Cave Story. Cave Story! My... Yeah. A good well, game. Good game, I like yes. <laughs> I love Cave Story. I've played it a lot of times. I've played it uh, like three times or so. Yeah. But you're going to so, be playing now. Yeah, I'm going to be playing now. So I erased all my saves. Yeah, hardcore like that. Yeah, and we're going to play. Not easy. Original. We could try hard, but that's... Yeah, look at this. I'm too afraid. Uh, I'm too afraid of that. No, uh, <laughs> well... Uh, are we though? Yeah, yeah. No, really? Yeah, it's it's really difficult. Yeah, I've done it. Okay, do it. <laughs> You've not finished it. Ah, uh, okay, uh, maybe <laughs> I've finished it. Let's start the game. Let's yeah, start the game. Someone's transmission. Ah, the music in this game is so good. It's the best. Okay. Beats rest. That's Kazuma. He's in a shelter. And he's sending out a signal, and there we are. Okay. Drop straight into the game. Save the game. Yay. Oh, Diddy, did you in introduce yourself? Oh, I'm Diddy. Yeah. And we're I'm playing Ragnar. Cave Story. Yeah, we're playing. Uh, you're playing Cave Story. Ah. I'll just be so, watching. This is the first cave. Wow. Yeah. It's Do you remember just a, this? Yes. It's this game Look. is just a bunch of caves. A life capsule. <laughs> we. Max life increased. So yeah, this this game. I think it was made by one guy. Yeah, one dude. It's That's a, amazing. Yeah, it's an amazing achievement. Especially if you like. The, the, yeah, especially considering how good this game is. Yeah. So ah, oh, he's asleep. I'll just take this treasure. <gasps> the Polar Star. Yeah, he'll upgrade it for us later, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, another transmission. Someone's transmission? Are, are we are we getting this transmission or something? No, no, we're not. We'll, we'll get to this later, actually. Do, 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 yeah. do. So he's just uh, searching for his sister, Sue. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now we can shoot with our pew, polar pew. star. Pew, pew, pew. Take we that. Can, we can grab triangles. Yeah, grab the triangles. Awesome. Do you remember what they do? Well, you can upgrade stuff. Yeah, just upgrade your weapon. So you see in the upper left corner, our weapon is level one. Oh yeah, and then you lose levels when you get hurt or something? Yes. Like, like sonic rings? Yes. Pew pew! Pew pew! Oh! Okay. I remember this one part where it's like, oh, you're following the storyline and there's these little people. They're like, "Oh, you wanna, you wanna grab a ride off this island, like with us?" And I was yeah. like, "Sure," <laughs> and just finished the game right there. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, come on, Sue, type something, will you? So many ways to end this game. Yeah, there are a few ways. Yeah, there's like a coward's way where you just leave the island. Well, yeah, but we'll we'll get to that later. I I did that a yeah. bunch of times. So, this is the Mimica Village. Yeah, so... Sue is an outsider. Yeah. Hey. What'd you have for dinner? Um, well... <laughs> just had some yogurt. With some muesli. That's funny, because I had yo... Yolk. Yolks? Yes, I had egg yolks. Really? Yeah. Oh, uh, just mm. raw egg yolks, or...? Well, uh, kind of raw. Kind of raw. What's, yeah, I had what do you some, mean by that? I had soft boiled eggs. Okay. And they were really soft boiled. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I've been okay. trying to get a hang of it with my well, just doing soft boiled eggs in a pot, and they've been pretty soft boiled. Yeah, maybe so, a bit too much then. Yeah, the whites were a bit soft as well. <laughs> so. So. It, it was very icky. Yeah. Uh, but so delicious. Yeah. I've gotten, uh, what do you say, the taste for human what did flesh. You say? <laughs> I've gotten the taste for human flesh. <laughs> but taste of human flesh. Nah, acquired a taste for yeah. egg yolks. Like, uh, 
raw ones. Well, not soft-boiled eggs, really. Because yeah. uh, I used to be all about the hard-boiled eggs, but I was never that fond of them. Cause, yeah. uh, and they're really dry in comparison. So now I like uh, soft-boiled eggs. They're awesome. Also, mm. like in toast with eggs. You had those, right? What? Where you take the middle piece of a toast out of an egg, and you, oh, shack, and you mm. like r put a put an egg egg on it, and you fry it in a pan. <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah. And then you got an egg with so toast first around pass. it. Look yeah. at this. Oh no! Fuck, <laughs> jerk! <laughs> Shot her. Uh, shot her. But Aww. she was the first boss. Oh. <laughs> not the doctor. <laughs> oh, she was? <laughs> yeah, I mean, not really, but... I, I like to think of her as the first boss. Uh, I, th I thought you were about to say, like, the lunchbox. <laughs> he was about to appear and... Uh, yeah. Fill up in our grill. Well, he's, he's about to appear. Yeah. Uh-oh. There he is. How old is this game? It must be like 10 years old by now. Yeah, I think it's more than 10 years old. We'll, we'll check. Misery. What was the other guy's name? Balrog uh, or something? Yeah. It's the Balrog. I'm not Sue. Oh no! Wah! <laughs> Mimika, wah! So here's the first... Kind of the, the real first boss. Yeah. <laughs> can but you he lose asks, against him? He asks, Do you want to fight with me? And I could just say no. Nah, fight him. Okay. Oh! Jump! Oh, jump! I got this. Ah! Oh! That's one powerful pea shooter. Yeah. Get wrecked, toaster. I'll remember this. <laughs> That's good. Okay, first boss defeated. Woo! Yeah, got some triangles. Some golden triangles. For my pea shooter. Are you gonna try and do everything? Uh, yeah, but there are, there are a few things. Like... Oh. Uh, there are some things that you can do... Uh, in one playthrough, like by doing some certain choices, and other other things you won't be able to do. Uh, like for example, there are a few guns that you can't, uh, like that you can get, but you can't get them all in the same playthrough. Ooh, yeah. So I just told him about Sue. No. Get out of here. I always go here. I don't think I have to. Have you checked the fire? Yeah. Uh, there's some stuff like that. Yeah. There's some stuff in the fire, actually. Fire indeed hot. Look, just go check James it. below in the fireplace. There's something on the other side. I can't we'll, get it. Yeah, we'll get it later. It's all, all right. right. Do you know... But first... Do you remember in the Canary Islands? When uh, I was looking for, like, clothes? Oh. Uh, yeah, sure. You were what? looking for clothes. What a Tunbury. Yeah, I, I, I wish I had found pants. I really wanted one, some of those, like, baggy Canary Island pants. Uh, I don't know. Baggy what Canary called. Island pants? Yeah, like, they were, like, Spanish pants. They were. Okay. Yeah, I kind of wish I had them now. Because, uh, I don't really have any pants. Really? <laughs> yeah. Uh, kind of. Yeah. The huge gaping hole in the crotch of my only pair of pants. <laughs> That's not good. I don't know where I can find a proper one. Like, I've tried a bunch of pants. Yeah. yeah. I went to uh, the mall the other day to look for pants, and I stepped into one shop uh, to look at some. Do you, do you remember this guy? Yeah, the small dude. Yeah, he's the one who can help me get off the island like a coward. Uh, he, he, he doesn't help you do it. You'll well, see his later. Family. No. Okay. He does something else. Well, wh whatever. Like, I, I went into a shop looking for pants, uh, but they only sold t-shirts. I was asking <laughs> the cashier or whatever. 
And he, he was the only one who was there, so it was like, he was the only one manning the shop. And there were like, um, three different Polish dudes. I, I think, no, nah, I can't say they were Polish, they were just foreign. <laughs> okay. uh, like, went into uh, a stall, all by, like, three of them into a single stall with a bunch of clothes. And, oh! <laughs> Really? <laughs> uh, well, that's not gonna appear on the on the recording anyway. The virus scan? Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, it was great though. Yeah. So. Yeah, the guys. They all three of them went into one stall, like to try on T-shirts apparently, <laughs> and the cashier was like, it, it probably pretty new, and asked me like. Wait, is that normal? Uh, the 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 guy being in there, and I was like, I don't know, I I'm not a cashier, but that's pretty weird to be honest. Like all three of them in there at the same time, and then like one dude comes out, like his uh, jacket zipped all the way up to his neck, and he's like holding a bag as well, uh, <laughs> and he walks out of the changing room just like <laughs> just whistling a song. And nobody, yeah. nobody whistles in real life. <laughs> it was like, <laughs> it was such a weird thing. It's like, nah, you were doing something, something wrong. You're <laughs> purposely trying to be inconspicuous by whistling. <laughs> nobody does that. Nobody People does do that. that in real life. No, P nobody People just do that. No, no, nobody just comes <laughs> out of a, a changing booth or whatever and just starts whistling <laughs> like casually. Like I'm not doing nothing. I do that all the time. <laughs> Well, you get stopped a bunch, and you're also you're stealing when you do it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's so, a blue dude over there. Should we? Should we? Yeah, call let's this? talk to him in the next episode. Yeah. All right.